all right so welcome back to my get ready with me it is christmas merry christmas you made it to december i am so happy can't you tell i'm like shimmy shimming for you <laughs> don't forget to like comment and subscribe but as before i start i want to light up my favorite candle of the season right now it's from bath and bar work it's called sweet rosemary vanilla it gives me that vibe when i do my makeup you know what i mean so yeah and it smells so delicious so as i'm sniffing of course i had to blow it off <laughs> so now i'm gonna have to lit it up one more time so i can get that sweet smell in my nose as i do my get ready with me let me know in the comments below what's your favorite uh, scented candle from bath and body works this season of christmas now we're ready to start but first my lips are dry so i'm using this uh, uh, lip tint that i got from boxy charm it's super delicious it tints your lips really properly but I'm also gonna use my lip gloss from TA you know get that lips glossy voluptuous you know get that lips delicious and sexy <laughs> I am so extra but yeah but again I'm gonna put my hair clips from Kadar oh yes you heard me from Kadar Kadar has some hair clips that is coming out very soon it's probably out by the time you see this video but yeah, so I'm gonna pin my hair back with my Kadara hair clips just so that the makeup doesn't go in my face. And we're gonna jam out to some music because I know you love that Apple beat. beat. So I did my eyebrow off camera. So we're gonna start with our Lucier, Lucier, Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I like to put it before I put my makeup because it helps my makeup to last very long throughout the day. So that's what I put on my face first. And I also put a serum. Uh, before the video started so I didn't need to do it on camera but yeah this is what we're doing right now and I'm gonna be using my favorite Estee Lauder foundation of this season I believe this shade is 5N 1.5 maple it is the best shade a girl can have <laughs> well at least for my shade <laughs> color I love it so much because it honestly lasts the whole day when I say the whole day like literally the whole day even one time maybe one or two would you know a couple times I, <laughs> I fell asleep with my makeup on and it literally stayed on till the next day crazy and it's just jamming up for a few seconds Ooh, yeah that's right <laughs> so I'm just gonna fast forward this part because it's a typical routine foundation so I'm just gonna like I said fast forward so you can see the process enjoy the afrobeat no. Baby, you mean more to me, more to me. Ooh. Promise, Bobby, call you back. Hey, yeah. Get that beat. Oh, oh get that beat. Yeah, yeah. Hey. <laughs> So now I'm gonna go in with my MAC um, concealer. It's my MAC concealer for the season. Honestly, I think next time I'm gonna be using Too Faced because I heard that was a really good concealer. It's good for now, but I really wanna try something different. I've been a loyal MAC uh, consumer. I think it's time for me to branch out. You know what I mean? Branch out. Let me know also what kind of concealer, looking at my skin tone, if you're my skin tone, what kind of concealer would you could recommend for me? Yo, girl, hydration, nothing MAC. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, girl, you have to blend, 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 blend. I think with one thing with concealer and foundation, it has to be blended so properly. And I'm going with my drugstore cream contour that I'm gonna use to contour my face. That's something recently I just added. I used to just powder contour, but now I'm cream contouring and also powder contouring, if you get what I mean. So I'm gonna contour my nose to just get that nose snatch though. You gotta get the nose snatch, that's all I'm saying. Snatch a root, snatch it. And your girl, I don't know, I was just feeling myself, even though my face was not blended properly, but I'm just like, let me just do, you know? <laughs> Anyways, I'm really hoping that everybody's having a wonderful December, the last month of the year, 2020. I know I am because God has been good all throughout the year. <laughs> anyway, so next thing I'm going to use is my Huda Booty. It's a loose powder that I use under my eyes. I'm not going to bake it because even from a pro uh, makeup artist, they say not to bake it. Like because it leaves it honestly even for myself it leaves mark under my eyes and I dislike it so I just use it very loosely with my brush and put it on my face 
And as you can see, I'm chit-chatting on this video because my sister decided to call me as I was recording this video. So we're having a very long conversation. So she's looking at me do all these crazy moves. Yeah, girl. Body roll. <laughs> oh my gosh but yeah so we're having a conversation throughout this whole video but anyways like i was saying this year has been very rough you know in different aspects but honestly i just thank god i made it through and just a heads up i'm using this uh morphe palette by manny mua and it's the best palette out here in these streets so go get yourself one girl trust me tell your boyfriend to get you one <laughs> but yeah on the real 2020 has been such a different year but honestly i honestly thank god for taking me through this year because i just feel like it made me a stronger person and it made me uh see things about my life that i didn't even know i had inside of me and it like pulled it out of me so i'm really thankful for this year honestly and i really hope that it challenged you in a really positive way and even though you may have had some downs i hope the ups overcame the downs because god is faithful he will always bring you through and that's one thing i've learned this year i've always known that but this year was so obvious and it's just a good reminder that god will always be there with me but yeah i'm gonna be using also this natasha d don't oh my gosh dinona it came with my boxy charm honestly i've never heard of her before but her palette is really amazing and it's very pigmented i really love it but before i get into her palette I'm going to use my MAC concealer to just put on my eyelid just to make the eyeshadow pop even more so it can be even more concentrated. That's a little, that's a little trick that I learned from someone, <laughs> probably from an MUA online, and I've been using it ever since. It's honestly the best. Look at my eyes though. Look at my eyes. I clearly forgot to even show you my eyeliner. It's from NYX. Clearly, um, you can't even see the NYX on it because I've used this so many times. But this is one of my all-time favorite eyeliners that I use. NYX, if you know any other eyeliners I should try, also put it down in the comments below because I want to know. Hey, And just for a few seconds, I love my Bob. Let me just say I love Bob. It's from my Kadar collection. Whoop, whoop. But yeah, I think I'm feeling really Bob's. I think it looks good on me and stuff, but... Anyways, just have to put it in. And one thing I also like to do is put some eyeshadow on my bottom um, eyelid. I think it's super cute. I think it just adds to your look. I just love it. I know it adds to my face. So if you've never tried it, I, I would suggest you to try it. Honestly, girl. Get it done because you got this. And I'm going again with my MAC. <laughs> MAC, please sponsor your girl. But yeah, so this MAC powder that I'm going to powder all my face. I know some people don't, don't powder their face no more, but I still do because I like it. It gives like a look of thing to my face and I love it. So yeah. <laughs> all right girl you looking cute so now we're gonna go with my morphe uh setting spray i love my morphe and i love also urban decay spray all nighter these are my two all-time favorite and i kind of ocd sometimes on the sprays so <laughs> look at me ocd <laughs> oh my gosh look at this look at that girl stop and now all for the bottom lashes with a mascara i don't always do that but sometimes i do just for this this look that i'm going for in this video i'm definitely gonna do it but i don't always do it but i do do it sometimes you know what i mean and now for another drugstore product, my bronzer. So we're gonna bronze the upper cheeks, not where you contour, but upper. I learned that from a, MU, a pro MUA. <laughs> so you said to bronzer upper on the upper side of your cheeks, your nose, and obviously your forehead. And then, ooh, girl, I'm gonna put some highlight on my cheeks. I was talking to my sister and I was showing her how the highlight looked because she could see it too. And girl, ooh, yes. Look at it shining. Hey, she knows she got it. Hey, 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 hey. 
<laughs> oh my god i love putting highlight because you just add even from afar you can see it it's like a woo mm, yes girl you got this And don't forget your nose. Oh my god, let it shine, bro. Let it shine bright, bright as a diamond. Honestly, I don't even know what I've been saying this whole voiceover, <laughs> but I also like to highlight the t uh, the corner of my forehead and obviously underneath my eyebrows. I think it just adds to your look. And also in person and in pictures, it looks really, really glamorous and cute and everything. So yeah. And I'm just gonna align my lips with. Uh, a pencil with a brown pencil and I'm just gonna apply some lip gloss honestly my lips are gonna keep, I'm gonna keep them simple I don't like too much stuff on my lips if ever I like to use a NYX cream like all these like brown shades something that's like neutral but yeah now it's time for the hair girl I took off my hair clips now it's time to just um, sh strain it in the bottom like I already strained it before this video but I'm just gonna restrain it the bottoms of it just to make it a pop more in the bottoms if you get what I mean yeah, just like that <laughs> She's looking fine, oh fine. Ooh, you a fine babe. Even my sister was telling me I look fine. <laughs> and now when I thought I was done, I forgot the most important part. I forgot my lashes. So I came back acting as if nothing happened. I put on my lashes off camera and I'm back, y'all. <laughs> looking cute. But now for the moment that you've all been waiting for, here is the outfit, girl. Yes, the outfit. It's coming in five seconds. Five, four. Three, two, one. Oh yes, come through with the holiday glam though. I'm loving this red wine top that I got from Dynamite. This leather pants that I got from Zara. But first girl, don't forget your perfume. And that's right, guess perfume and a quick lipstick for your lips. Mwah. And now for the purse. This is a very cute clutch that I got actually from Spring. Super duper cute. I paired it with some silver earrings and some cute clear heels I also got from Spring. Wow, girl, you look so fine. Fine, babe. Hey, fine, babe. <laughs> yes, girl. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And come back for more.